So we're going to start by opening our browser and in this case we are using Chrome. So we're going to open Chrome and then we're going to search YouTube, youtube.com. So when you search youtube.com, you're going to be directed to YouTube and you're on your right hand corner at the top, there's this arrow here. You're going to tap on that arrow and then scroll down until you get desktop site here you're going to tap on desktop site so when you tap on desktop site it's going to look like this this is how your youtube looks on your on your computer yeah this is how it looks on your computer or, or on your laptop so when you tap on that again you're going to go back to your right right hand side still on your right hand side i'm going to click on that icon again the one that has your youtube profile picture and then you're going to tap on your channel so when you tap on your channel, you're going to be directed to your channel. As you can see, this is my YouTube channel. It's called Redesigns Kenya. As you can see, my content, if you're interested in such kind of content, if you'd like to learn how to make nose rings, keychains, bracelets, and also if you'd like to know where you can get materials to make such in Nairobi, kindly check my content out. And kindly, as you do that, don't forget to subscribe. So back to what brought us here. On your left hand side you see where it's written your your youtube name there's that again there's that icon that round one this one so i'm going to tap on that tap choice so when you tap you're going to be directed to youtube studio so it's taking a while to load and there you go so at this stage you can even change your profile picture your youtube profile picture you can change your banner image you can add watermarks to your videos uh, but no, that's not what brought us here let's continue so on your on your left hand side now there's that menu that's that's going all the way down so you're going to scroll there's, there's some icons that are hiding so you're going to scroll until you get to this icon that looks musical you're going to tap on that so when you tap on that you're going to be directed to music library that we are going to get all our songs as you can see wow there are very many you can get soundtracks you can get music you can get music of any mood that you want romantic mood if you want happy mood if you want sad if you want suspense music you can get all that so if you want to play a track before you download it you're going to click here and it's going to play yeah. Um, as you can hear so if you want to download a track you, let's say you're downloading this you're going to tap on where it's written the date there and then it's going to download as you can see it's downloaded so it's going to go to your music in your phone so even if you're editing your video without internet you'll be able to access the music because it goes to where you save your music in your phone and that's the easiest way to do it i think because sometimes uh people edit videos on on the move on the go so maybe you're moving around and you're editing videos you're using your phone maybe you don't have internet so you don't even need to to keep downloading just download your music store them in your phone and when you're editing you just access them from your phone and so i hope this video was um helpful to you guys i hope it's going to help you create more content and kindly um stay around for more content from me and don't forget to subscribe thank you so much bye